everybody! Kiara here back with some more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond for the Nintendo Switch. Last time we left off, we caught all three Lake Guardians in Lake Valor, Verity, and Acuity. We caught Azelf, Uxie, and Mesprit. And now we are trying to hatch this egg, so I'm just gonna run. Just gotta run. Oh, I forgot I was using a repel. Nope. Okay, let's go. Just gonna run. That's how to hatch an egg, right? If I look at the egg, could I see how close it is to hatching? So just like look at the egg. No, is that not what I could do? Um. Okay. Could I look at the egg? Could I see how close it is to hatching? Because that's really all I need to do right now. Its name is Egg. Okay. Was given by Riley. It appears to move occasionally, maybe close to hatching. Okay. Nice. Let's go. So this is basically all I need to do at the moment. And then I would have completed the Pokedex. Which is awesome. Sorry guys, um, how are you guys doing? <laughs> While I uh, babysit this egg, uh, let's talk about life. How are you guys enjoying my playthroughs? Of course you guys could comment down below how uh, I could improve anything. Uh, make sure you guys check out QR Play Store, link in the description below. You could check out my first design on shirts and hoodies. It's called the What the Fudge design. It's the original catchphrase I came up with. Um, let me know any ideas you want for future designs. I will totally get on that. I'm just gonna run back and forth you guys as you can see. Because all it takes is walking, right? To hatch an egg in this game, you literally they had to walk with that. Just have to walk with it. Okay, let's check up on it again. I walked a lot. The egg will hatch soon. Nice. Okay. This running thing is doing really well. Okay. The egg will hatch soon. Just a matter of seconds. In 10, 9, 8, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and and <laughs> and 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 one and uh and uh one and three quarters and one and one uh uh one half I don't even know math anymore um and a go and hatch and you can do it and a go come on come on egg and go. <laughs> you guys can't see it, but as I'm saying go, I'm pointing at the TV. Like, and go. <laughs> okay, it's so close. It's so close. I could feel it. I could feel it, you guys. I could feel it. In my bones. Will using my bike make it go faster? Oh, there it is. <laughs> nice. I got it. I was gonna be like, well, using my bet, my my bike, make it go faster. Cause that'd be awesome. Here it is, you guys. Riolu is the final Pokemon I need for the Pokedex. Isn't that crazy? Riolu, out of all Pokemon, is the final Pokemon I need to complete my Pokedex. Okay. 
that should be it. Let's check my Pokédex. There are some Pokémon that I have not actually caught yet, you guys. But yet, they're not listed in the Sinnoh Pokédex. So... Yeah. Uh, and I'll tell you guys what I mean in a bit. Okay, that seems to be all. But like... Yeah, there are some Pokémon that I have not yet caught yet that aren't listed in the Pokédex. Which are... Fione is one of them. I mean, maybe because Fione is technically not a Sinnoh Pokémon, I guess it's... Yeah, I guess it's just not technically a Sinnoh Pokémon, but still. Uh, Darkrai and, Chris and Cresselia aren't in the Pokédex either. They don't seem to be in the Pokédex, or else they'll be at the very bottom. Um, yeah, and I'm not going to be catching Cresselia anytime soon, you guys. <laughs> not going to. Um, and yeah, you guys, you guys know why. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just done with the game, you know? Alright, so I finished the Pokédex. Hopefully if I go here, to the fight area, I could explore these, these areas where I have not been yet. I hope. So here's the fight area, if I go this way. Howdy trainer, you have a Pokédex, do you? Yep. Wait. Oh, I have to actually talk to him first? Okay, I think... I think they're actually saying I have to talk to Professor Rowan first. I will do that. You guys, this is like the first game ever. <laughs> Just kidding. The first um, game that I actually completed the Pokedex. Let me take a look at your Pokedex. Awesome, you've seen every kind of Pokemon in Sinnoh. Have you shown this Pokedex to Professor Rowan yet? I am about to. Okay, technically that's not every kind, though. Technically that's not every kind. I still don't have Cresselia or Fione. I was hoping to get Fione, but... But, uh, I don't know. Bravo, you've recorded all the Pokémon of Sinnoh in your Pokédex. This will help immeasurably with my studies of Pokémon evolution. Greetings, Professor Rowan. It's been a very long time. I'll tell you, Sinnoh certainly is a long trip from Kanto. Of course, if it means meeting new Pokemon, there's no distance too great for the likes of us to travel. Oh, if it isn't my old colleague, Professor Oak. I should have expected as much from the world's authority on Pokemon. We always used to joke, where there are Pokemon, you'll find Oak. It's good to see that hasn't changed one bit. Professor Oak, let me introduce you to my young assistant. This youngster has filled every page of the Sinnoh Pokedex for me. Ah, oh, well, very glad to meet you. Have you heard? My name is Oak. I've been hearing a great deal about you from Professor Rowan lately. He's been exuberant in praise about a fantastic young trainer. I see that you live up to... No, that you've surpassed his praise. You've got... You've also got an impeccable sense of timing. You see, I had an errand to run for Professor Rowan on my visit here. He had asked me to bring the data from the National Pokedex. So since you're here, let me upgrade your Pokedex with the National Mode. Oh god. Are you gonna make me, like, find all the national Pokémon, too? You better not, Professor Oak. I'm afraid it won't be easy to complete the national Pokédex. However, I'm sure you will make an honest attempt on our behalf. Have no fear. Kiara will get the job done. By the way, Professor Oak, what compelled you to visit this region? Ah, oh, yes, I've heard that Ramanus Park is now open. If I remember correctly, it's at the end of Route 221. Ramanus Park has a special system that attracts every imaginable kind of Pokemon from every region. I've come to make certain that system is operating properly. You should make an effort to visit Ramanus Park too. Oops, I'll be late for my meeting if I don't get going. Okay, it was a pleasure seeing the both of you. Bye now. Okay, off he goes, as busy as ever. Now Kiara. I have a gift here as a reward for completing the Sinnoh Pokédex. Pokey Radar. That's Pokemon Radar or just Pokey Radar for short. Use it and it will indicate grass patches where Pokemon are lurking. I'd prepared that to help my field assistants put together the Sinnoh Pokédex, but you took care of that. 
I'm sure it'll be useful for your goal of fulfilling the national Pokedex. I I did not say that was gonna be my goal at all, sir. <laughs> that that is not gonna be my goal. It's just not gonna be my goal. Hi there, it's been a while. When I heard that you to see the uh I can't speak anymore. When I heard that you defeated the Elite Four and entered the Hall of Fame, I rushed straight here to congratulate you. I mean it I mean it, great job. Although the gym leaders are really happy for you too. But you know, we gym leaders aren't going to take this lying down. Losing to you was rough on all of us, yet we still have our pride as Sinnoh's eight gym leaders. Now we're all determined to beat you this time. So if you don't mind, could you give us all another chance with the Pokemon battle? We'll each be waiting for you at our own gyms. You know where to find me, Orbrick Gym. Oh my god, for real? Do I have to? Do I get something really special if I do this? Is there seriously more post-game stuff? Oh my god, you guys. Try adventuring all over the Sinnoh region. Um, sure. Let's go here first, though, because I really want to check out these new areas. You guys. I was thinking the Pokedex was the last thing I had to do for post-game. <laughs> but... I was totally wrong about that. These people are gone. Uh-huh, nothing's as super duper as a super rod, wouldn't you agree? Sure. Super duper minds think alike. Taste this take the super rod. Okay, sure. I will never use that. <laughs> never gonna use that. The survival area is past here. Stark Mountain is this way too. I should catch me some wicked Pokemon for the battle tower. Didn't Barry say he was going to Stark Mountain? Oh god, I literally just stepped foot in the grass. Oh my god. A skunk tank. In the wild? That doesn't happen in nature. That doesn't happen. Level 51 too, and I forgot I had this Pokemon out. Okay, let's run away for now. I completely forgot I had Tentacle. Alright, so I'm gonna switch you out. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and keep Riolu in my team as well. So I could train. Alright. Let's see what there is to see. A lot of trainers. I let my bird Pokemon carry me wherever, and so here I am. I guess if I'm gonna be taking on the eight gym leaders again, a little warm up couldn't hurt. God, I guess that's what I'm gonna be doing, huh? I was thinking this would actually be the finale episode, but I guess it won't be. Oh, and also Farfetch is not registered in my Pokedex, so that's cool. I'm already, <laughs> I'm already filling up that national dex, you guys. Already doing it. Seeing new Pokemon past the, past these areas that I haven't been yet. Counter. No, I'm hardly gonna use you, so. You don't need these moves. Swellow. Pokemon from Hoenn. I guess this is the first time I'm seeing new Pokemon, actually. From different regions and stuff? I never even like noticed that. All the Pokemon I ever saw in Sinnoh were actually from Sinnoh. I legit never even noticed that. I thought there were at least some Pokemon that were from like Kanto or Johto. But nope, they were all from Sinnoh. And now I'm actually seeing Pokemon from different regions. Sheesh! I arrive in a new place and it turns out to be the battle zone. Yep. That was a mistake on your part. In the embrace of Mother Nature, people and Pokemon grow strong. Alright, what new Pokemon do you have for me? Ranger. Zigzagoon, also from Hoenn. Okay. I can do Zigzagoon. 
can deal with you. I'm gonna have to heal soon. And I just got here. Alright. Okay, level 20. Rock Smash, sure. I'll let you use Rock Smash. Skarmory. Also from Zeno. I mean, from Hoenn. <laughs> also from Hoenn. I don't even know my regions anymore. Alright. Sweet. Level 22. Thank you, Ashley. My, you are tough. I sure am. What kind of Pokemon do you have? Right after this, you will send a Pokemon to battle me. Psychic Daisy. Ooh, a uh, Kanto Slowpoke. Have I seriously never come across Slowpoke before? Like, for real? I guess I haven't. Wait a sec. I came across Psyduck, right? Literally just last episode, I came across Psyduck. And that's in Kanto. So, if I look at my Sinnoh Pokedex, is Psyduck not listed? Because it's not a Sinnoh Pokemon? Huh. Questions. I got questions, you guys. I got some questions I need answering. Please tell me you also have a, a Slowking. If you have Slowpoke and Slowbow, you better have a Slowking. Just saying. You do not have a Slowking. You only have two Pokemon. Dang it! Now how am I supposed to... Um... Get my Pokedex done? If you will not show me a Slowking. Alright, it's fine. It's fine. Level 24. I'm seriously getting a lot of experience from these people. Right after this, I have to pay out your prize money. Yep. You sure do. Alright, I could surf that way. I don't know why I'd want to do that. I guess let's try it. Okay, what is this way? There's a house over there. What kind of Pokemon are over here? Ooh, a Fero. Interesting. So yeah, I guess just beyond that, those people that wanted me to complete the Pokedex, beyond this area, I mean beyond that area, the battle area, is the gold mine to different Pokemon from different regions. So this is the this is the place to go, you guys. Post game? Post game stuff, here we come. Alright, uh I'll take this. Ultra ball. Okay. Let's go this way. Um okay. I'm back here, I went in a circle. There is a single Pokeball over here. I will gladly accept. Ooh, a rare candy. Okay. Okay. Uh. Let's see. I can't go that way, right? I have to go this way. Ooh, eradicate. Okay then. 
Come at me, Radicate. Come at me if you dare. Nice. Since you're that low on on health, I might as well catch you. If you had not destroyed yourself. <laughs> I mean, I guess I'm kind of glad you destroyed yourself. I mean, I don't have to catch every Pokemon, as we saw from the last few episodes. As we learned. I don't have to catch every Pokemon. So I guess I'm kind of happy that you killed yourself. But yet, yeah, kind of sad. Ooh, a Roselia. Okay. Roselia. From Hoenn. Jopek. Roselia is one of the Pokemon I actually caught before. Because I had a Badoo. But of course it's in this area because Roselia are only found in Hoenn. Like, the reason I got one in Sinnoh was because I evolved a Badoo, which is only found in Sinnoh. It's kind of complicated. <laughs> Alright. Okay, what's this way? Why is there, like, an empty spot there? Don't know. Alright, I'm over here now. Talk to you. We go on patrol to make sure there's nothing strange going on, and occasionally we battle. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Ranger Dwayne. Don Van. From Hoenn. Alright. Take this. And of course you have Sturdy. You just have to have Sturdy. Ooh. You know, Giga Impact. That is a powerful move. At least it looks powerful. It was not that powerful, though. It only looks powerful. It sounds powerful, it looks powerful, it does not feel powerful. <laughs> Alright, I like how I'm looking at all these new Pokemon, you guys. All these new Pokemon. To me, in the Sinnoh region. I've totally seen every Pokemon before. Like, I could name all the Pokemon names. Or, like, if I see a picture of a Pokemon, I'm pretty sure I could give you the name for it. Um... Actually, that's probably a lie. Not every Pokemon I know. Okay, let's go for a walk together. Ooh, I don't think I've ever walked with you before. On we arrive. There's something missing in the way of battle. I've come here to find it. And what is that? Have you found it yet? Not sure. Ooh, a lick a tongue. Okay. Own temple. Not sure what that does, but it cancelled out my attack, so. Cancelled my ability. But it's fine. I didn't need it. Ow. There you go. You are not learning Screech. Not learning Screech. Miltank. Also from Kanto. What is with you and having moves that completely squish me? 
For real. What is with you? And having moves that completely squish me. Flat. I was just squished flat. I see it now. I know what I lack. And what's that? Tell me. What do you lack? Are you traveling as a form of training? Here, have this refreshing drink. Bottle of fresh water. Water is the wellspring of life. Having said that, no one knows where Pokemon life originated. I know who originated it. That being Arceus. Arceus is the god of Pokemon. <laughs> Jar of Lax Incense? What the heck? Don't know what that does. My team's been trained through and through. You'll shake when you see how tough they are. I don't know about that. But come at me. Pinsir. Has Pinsir always been silver like that? Like, isn't Pinsir supposed to be brown? Are there different Pinsir that I don't know about? And this is clearly not a shiny Pinsir, right? Because it would be sparkling. I could have sworn shiny Pinsir were gray like that. But yet... What is it? The last few games that I've actually played... Last few Pokemon games that I've played, it always had the Pinsir being gray when they weren't shiny. In the anime, they're totally, you know, not shiny. I mean, they're not gray. They are totally not gray. So I'm confused. Oh, shiny pins are blue. I always thought they were gray. Okay. Shiny pins are blue and their horns are yellow. Okay. Alright. So I guess... Pins are now these... You know, nowadays are... Always gray? Like, they're supposed to be brown. Because they're bugs, right? Since when are bugs gray? <laughs> Since when are bugs gray? I mean, there's plenty of bugs that aren't... Uh, brown or black in Pokemon. But still, since when are bugs gray? Alright. Nice. Level 31, 30. I mean, I mean 71. <laughs> 71, 30, and 64. I'm just shaking all over. Good. I have that effect on people. Okay, um... Where am I going? Gotta go this way. Lot of grass. There is a lot of grass here. Where are the opponents? The search for them drives me to travel far. Interesting. Very, very interesting. Ace Trainer Dina. Flaffy. Okay. Electric versus electric. Come at me, Flaffy. Ooh, that was powerful. Tropius. Okay. Not bad. Ooh. Solar Beam. It takes two attacks, though, so... 
It'll take a while. And thankfully, that while will not come. <laughs> it will not come. Level 31. I've certainly found a tough adversary in you. Thank you? Is that a compliment? I don't know what that means. Alright. What kind of Pokemon are here, you guys? Ooh, I found the survival area. You guys, uh, come back next time. This will be the end of this episode. So come back next time and we will check out this whole survival area. See what's going on here. And, um, yeah. So, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe for more content. And I'll see you guys next time for more.